in the moment tonight, I want to talk to you about divine intervention and saying thank you. Now, you don't think those two things go together, and I get it. But everything in life happens for a reason, and I always stress that on this show all the time. Everything in life happens for a reason. Sometimes you go for an interview and you don't get the job. And you're like, oh, I thought I deserved that job. I thought that job was mine. And you wallow in sorrow and you get upset, you get depressed, you get angry. Or maybe it's an audition. Or maybe you get rejected by a boyfriend or girlfriend. And you're like, why? Why does it not happen for me? What I want you to do is this. Instead of wallowing in your sorrow, say thank you. Say thank you, ma'am. Thank you, lady. Thank you, sir. Appreciate the opportunity. Because... Every single, every single door that is closed is closed for a reason. Because down the hall, around the corner, up the street, the door will open. The door that you might have closed might have been the door for a smaller mansion. The door that you have opened is a, is a door for a palace or a castle or your kingdom. So understand that every time you have a setback, just say thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, lady. Thank you, sir. If you could do that, you'd be surprised of how that gratefulness will play out in your next opportunity, in your next big performance, in your next chance at living your dream. So remember this one thing. Anytime you feel down, you feel out, life has dealt you a hard hand, it's been a bad day for the home team, just say it. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, sir. Thank you, lady. And be grateful. Because grateful is the greatest prayer that anyone can have. And on that note, I want to say to all of you, I am so grateful for your support. And your and every night before I go to bed, it's just true, it's true things, true words, I think to myself of what you guys have been able to get, let the Fowler Show do. You've allowed us to not only live our dreams, but beyond living our dreams, you've allowed us to tell the news how it deserves to be told. True, real, and uncensored. And we thank you for that. And for that, we are truly grateful.